Hey everyone, I uh, just started getting this thing uh, finally together. Actually had to open this section back up. So that guy goes in there, right there. So I'll just glue him back in. But I noticed that uh, when I powered everything up, it would run for a little bit. And it was like a 50-50 chance that my uh, Dragon Link would get a connection. So I started messing around with it and realized that I was running out of power because uh, this guy has a 3 amp switching uh, BEC in it so I guess uh, running two MG90S's the Dragon on screen display the KK board down in there and the receiver was just too much so what I've done now is I have the Dragon on-screen display and the receiver powered from the switching BEC and then I put another 3 amp u back in here to power the KK board and the servos. So that's how it's going to go. Now it powers up fine. Everything looks good. So that was it. Hit a uh, it's definitely interesting when you run out of power because the uh, Dragon Link just lost connectivity. It didn't shut off, nothing. It just, the link light on it would actually uh, just shut off. So, after I uh, did a couple tests, disconnected the KK board and only had the Dragon on screen display and the uh, Dragon Link powered, everything went fine. So that's why I uh, isolated the UBEC, the only thing going to it now, or isolated the KK board and put a UBEC on it. All it has now is uh, signal wires, because the ground is actually through the UBEC. So, should work good there. Test it, fired it back up, everything ran good. So now I just have uh, configuring the on-screen display, and closing this guy back up. So uh, hopefully my uh, GPS will come in soon, and I can put it on here, and I'll have uh, GPS stabilization with uh, the stabilization of the KK board as well. And then the KK I could put into auto level mode or stabilize. I'm not sure which one I'll use yet, but we'll see after testing. Thanks for watching. Chan Yo, out.